Hey, fans of space, were you aware that in 2023 something extraordinary will occur in the vast expanse of space? Think of it like this, two superpowers, the US and China, are in a thrilling race away from our planet. But what really happened out there, and who was in charge? Let's dive into this cosmic adventure and uncover the secrets that are reshaping our future among the stars. The Emergence of a New Space Race Recent launches have fueled headlines of a new space race between the United States and China, depicting intense competition for supremacy. Yet, the reality of this cosmic contest is far from a conventional race. The Cosmic Clash Begins the United States and Soviet Union captured the world's imagination with their space race in the 20th century. But this is the 21st century, and we're beginning a new chapter. As a global player, China aims not only at the stars but also to rival the US in space. Imagine, as the giants fight for supremacy in a final cosmic war, that world's gaze shifts from Earth to the heavens. Dissecting the disparity US dominance in space exploration, the current scenario has often been described as a race between the United States and China in the realm of space exploration. However, this characterization may inadvertently suggest that the two nations possess roughly equivalent capabilities in space-related endeavors. In reality, the United States maintains a substantial lead not only over China but also over all other spacefaring nations combined in several critical domains. Financial Prowess in fiscal year 2021, the United States allocated an impressive $59.8 billion to its space program, while China's space budget for the same year was approximately $16.18 billion. This significant financial gap underscores the United States' substantial economic advantage in the field of space exploration. Satellite Supremacy Moving on to satellite technology, the United States enjoys a commanding lead in the sheer number of active satellites in orbit around our planet. Currently, there are a total of five, 465 operational satellites traversing the Earth's skies. Of this vast fleet, the United States operates a remarkable three, 433 satellites, constituting an impressive 63% of the global total. In stark contrast, China's presence in space is represented by a significantly smaller constellation of 541 satellites. This disparity reaffirms the United States' preeminence in satellite technology and deployment. Spaceport Superiority In the world of spaceports, the U.S. leads with seven operational launch sites and 13 in development worldwide, offering immense mission flexibility. In contrast, China manages just four spaceports, with two more planned domestically. This disparity underscores the United States' significant advantage in launching payloads into space. Launch Activity In the year 2021, China conducted 55 orbital launches, slightly outpacing the United States, which recorded 51 launches. However, a deeper examination reveals that these launches serve distinct purposes. Notably, 84% of China's launches were dedicated to government or military objectives, primarily focused on electronic intelligence and optical imaging. Conversely, in the United States, the majority of launches, accounting for 61%, were allocated to non-military, academic, or commercial endeavors, with a predominant emphasis on Earth observation and telecommunications missions. Space Stations in space station dynamics, significant differences emerge. The U.S., in collaboration with 14 nations, including Russia, has operated the extensive 16-module International Space Station ISS, since the 1990s, a hub for scientific and technological advances. However, the ISS is set for retirement in 2030 after 24 years of service. Meanwhile, China's Tiangong Space Station, a newcomer with just three modules, reached completion in late 2022. Despite inviting other nations, China exclusively manages construction and launches, presenting a distinct approach to space station operations. The Collaborative Landscape U.S. Dominance 
A significant differentiator between the United States and China in the realm of space exploration lies in the nature and extent of their international collaborations. This divergence underscores the unique dynamics shaping their respective cosmic endeavors. U.S. Alliances. For decades, NASA, the United States' premier space agency, has actively cultivated an extensive network of international and commercial partnerships. These collaborations span a broad spectrum, ranging from joint ventures in developing cutting-edge space technologies to facilitating crewed missions into the cosmos. Furthermore, the U.S. government has entered into a staggering 169 space data-sharing agreements, encompassing 33 states and intergovernmental organizations, 129 commercial partners, and seven academic institutions. This expansive web of alliances underscores the United States' commitment to fostering global cooperation in space exploration. China's Space Collaborations China partners with nations like Russia and Asia-Pacific Space Cooperation Organization members, Iran, Pakistan, Thailand, Turkey, for its space initiatives. Yet, these alliances, while valuable, involve fewer nations with less advanced space capabilities compared to U.S. Collaborations Lunar Aspirations Differing Strategies U.S and Chinese lunar ambitions, while both seeking lunar exploration and bases, reveal distinct collaboration approaches and scales. China-Russia Lunar Mission In 2019, China and Russia initiated a joint lunar mission aiming for a 2028 lunar landing. Russia offers Luna landers and Oriol crewed orbiters, while China advances its Chang'e robotic spacecraft. They propose the International Lunar Research Station, welcoming global participation, yet no other nations have joined this endeavor. U.S.-led Artemis Accords Since 2020, 24 nations have united under the U.S.-led Artemis Accords. This agreement sets fundamental principles for collaborative space endeavors, with a focus on returning humans to the moon by 2025 and establishing a lunar base and space station. The Artemis program emphasizes international participation, promoting a global approach to lunar exploration. Private Sector Engagement The Artemis program extensively involves the private sector, from lunar landers to space technologies. This fusion of government and private expertise showcases the comprehensive U.S. approach to lunar exploration. Global Space Competition Beyond China Diverse Challengers While China is often seen as the primary U.S. space rival, numerous nations possess space capabilities and ambitions comparable to or surpassing China's. India's Lunar Plans India, with significant space investments, aims to return to the moon, potentially partnering with Japan soon. Multinational Lunar Ambitions Several countries, including South Korea, Israel, Japan, the United Arab Emirates, Turkey, Germany, and the European Union, are planning independent lunar missions, diversifying lunar exploration. Conclusion with the burning question. In 2023, who will reign supreme in space? The United States or China? Will it be a shared cosmic conquest or a solitary ascendancy? Let us know your thoughts in the comment below. Watch our other video on Is Russian Space Program Dead? And we will see you soon.